please tell me. How is it that someone in your line of work is not aware that the butter knife is placed handle to the right, blade facing left? Just so. For God's sake. Mrs. Whitmore? Yes. My name is Desmond Hume. I work for your husband. Oh, of course, Mr. Hume. Charles has told me so much about you. It's a travesty we haven't met before. No, oh, it's about time. Well, the feeling is mutual, Mrs. Whitmore. Oh, please, it's Eloise. Eloise. <laughs> so, uh, what crisis forced Charles to send his best fix-it man into the bowels of charity balls? <clears throat> well, Eloise, um, I'm deeply sorry but it appears as if uh, Drive Shaft won't be able to perform alongside your son. And uh, I take full responsibility. Don't worry about it. Excuse me? Oh, my son will understand. I suppose if one employs so-called rock stars, certain unpredictability comes with the territory. <laughs> uh, you're not angry? Oh, not at all, dear. <laughs> What happened, happened. Thank you so much, Mr. Hume, for coming and telling me in person. A pleasure meeting you. And you. Uh, center that flower arrangement, please. Have a good evening. Thank you. Lifer, Stephanie, plus two. Marky, Mary, plus one. Milton, Penny, Solo. Pepper, Nicholas, plus one. Excuse me. I'm sorry. Um... Did you just say Penny? And who are you? Um, I work for Mr. Whitmore. May I see the list? You absolutely may not. That list is confidential. Begging your pardon, I, no, I'm entrusted with confidential items. Are you questioning me? No, I just want to look at one name on that list. And if for some reason that's a problem... Come with me. Everyone, now. Look, I'm I'm sorry if I've overstepped my bounds, but Stop I just Stop talking, Hume. I've heard what you've had to say. Now you listen to me. I want you to stop. Stop? S stop what? Someone has clearly affected the way you see things. This is a serious problem. It is, in fact, a violation. So whatever you're doing, whatever it is you think you're looking for. You need to stop looking for it. Do you, do you know what I'm looking for, Mrs. Whitmore? I don't know why you're looking for anything. You have the perfect life. On top of it, you've managed to attain the thing you've wanted more than anything. My husband's approval. How do you know what I want? Because I bloody do. I need to see that list. Or well, you need to tell me why I can't. Can't? Because you're not ready yet, Desmond. Ready? Re ready for what? 